All right. We're actually on schedule. I know. This is a part of the video where I say what we're doing this morning. And we're on schedule. So and we're on schedule. Look, time. it's night out. It's like, uh, I need I need to know what time it is. 4.45. 445. Uh, we're on our way to Columbus Farmer's Market. Uh, everybody wants to shop it and see. We watch videos of people finding great stuff, right? Me too. On Instagram. AJ does, yeah, yeah on it's Instagram. Ready. It's it might rain around noon. Uh, yeah, 11 to noon, something like that. But by that time, we yeah, should literally be out of George, heading out of there. Buddy George said by 11 o'clock, we Yeah, yeah, by by 11, we ought to be. We should be heading out of there anyway because we got to get to the store. Arby's for our folks yes, yeah, we're getting. We're gonna go to Arby's. Where's Arby's? AJ's gonna go to the Bagel Bums. Get like uh, a bagel. You know, I'll share a bagel with you. Wendy, yeah. It just, I don't know. Can you hear RJ in the background? Is that a second? Is that a second? Um, Stop. Right. Oh, AJ, AJ will tell us how to get there. Yeah, yeah. I want to say. The only reason why we found out about it is one time we had to end this meeting and we were like, no, let's not go to Wendy's. And we're like, Arby's? We're like, let's go. And then we found it. Yeah, you know AJ knows where all the Arby's are. I know. He knows where all the Wawa's are. That's like me knowing where all the Dunkin' Donuts are. <laughs> yeah. I know where all the Arby's are. Yeah. Like That's yeah. right. Uh, the Wawa's. Oh, yeah, the Wawa's for sure. Good checks. <laughs> yeah, because they let you use the bathroom. Yeah. Well, also, truck stops do too. But oh, yeah, but where's the truck stop? Right yeah, the truck stops will be on this road, maybe. Yeah, we're getting on I 95. The turnpike. The turnpike. Yeah. Straight and crowded. Well, we're, get, we're gonna get the monthly too. Oh, you wanna do the windows up? Well, are you gonna hear wind on your. Nah, it's okay. You can hear it. It, it usually doesn't pick up wind. Actually, the, the the camera on this mic isn't too bad. I brought a I brought those those little knockoff GoPros. I'll do a little filming of it. That's right. Gonna be watching this right. I don't know. I think you could probably hear AJ in the back. Yeah, I think so. Just turn up the volume. Not no way, Jose. Yeah, yes way, Jose. You don't know way, Jose is a wrestler. Look at the pretty lights. No way, Jose is a wrestler. No, I did not know that. I did not know that. Song goes, no way, Jose. No way. <laughs> That's funny. Jose. Yeah. We have uh, GI Jose, right? Okay? He, he knows all uh, the GI Joes. Yes. All right. Anyway, now you know what we're doing. You know what we're up to. Uh, we're going to get the monthly, although we may or may not use it. Did George say he would take it if we don't use it? Yeah, there you go. Because I guess George doesn't have to take the monthly, he just shows up. He hates waiting. Yeah, everybody hates waiting. So that we should get the monthly, you could drive in like a rock star. You know? You're just like, hey, look at that long line. As you drive past it. <laughs> look at how long the line is. The, wow, it goes all the way around like four I times. That, I like the monthly plan that you just set up. You know? Yeah, that's it. You just, you know where you go and. Oh, yeah. I, I was wondering if they were going to do the two spots like they were doing the years before. Oh, no. George said to go into the other section. So if you get to the other section, He was saying, What's the other section? Don't let them put you here, but they don't put you anywhere. You go and you find your own spot. No, if you get the monthly, you have to. No, you got a spot. No, I, I thought he meant for when we go there today. No, 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 no. They just say go wherever. Just to go. Bye, bye. Did you get there? Oh, it's full. You know, the, the gated area. Yeah. Nah, I don't care. I mean, everybody's like, oh, the that's gated the, area. That's the, gated the area. antique section? Yeah. Where's this bunch of stupid crap we don't want anymore section? Because that's what we brought. No, I actually, I think we actually bought some stuff that's very sellable. I, I think we'll make between 2 and 600. Yeah, it's, it's possible. I, I bought the electric scooter. I bought the uh, all those shelves. Sorry, Jay. Oh, you bought the three DS. Yeah, you did. Oh, I did. Oh, yeah, yeah. I don't remember. Jason watched the video from because I told him that Ben and Anderson told me any of it. He was like, "Don't bring it. I want to buy it." But then he didn't come. No, I saw you did. No, no, I bought it. Oh, okay. Okay. All right. Well, I the car semi loaded. I didn't go crazy, but I put a lot of stuff. I even brought this those. This exit used to be. AJ. Yeah, and now they, they got easy pass. Easy pass. How much is it? I have not a clue. It's probably not, ex well, it's probably at least three or four dollars. Right? If it was open, we could sneak on into the Meadowlands without yeah. me and the AJ toll. knows. Yeah, now now but it's now oh. it's, they put an easy pass. Oh, yeah, yeah, because they're greedy. 
Yeah. Yeah, American Dream is greedy. You know what? We look local enough where we can just pick a local one. Can we get oh, to American yeah. Dream local? Yeah. Huh. yeah oh my God! Now you see, you see why he doesn't drive? I don't know that. I thought the only oh, way to get there was. You know where we stop? I never go to American Dream. Oh wait, yeah, but I don't know. You know, it's like I don't really think of American Dream as part of the flea market. It's, the it's like this weird. Land. Yeah, I guess. Now I know we don't have to pay the tolls, but now we're gonna pay the tolls. It'll be like what, ten bucks each way? Oh my they god! They raised the tolls. So I'm not. Rat sure. bastards. It'll be like fifty dollars to get it there. Might be. <laughs> it used to be like nine dollars. I thought it, it's just like just to get for us to get to the Meadowlands. It's like ten. Yeah, it's gonna be. Yeah, that's right, Columbus. So uh, ten dollars, ten dollars, and 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 then uh, gas. Here, I'll show you what a tow ticket looks like. Can you see this? Let me see if I can see the rates. Yeah, look at AJ look at it. Yeah, I know. No, I'm just showing how. Uh, I don't know if people can see it because it's dark. But you can see how expensive it is. It's like expensive. It's like double digits. Florida, I don't know. It'd be expensive. No, actually, it, it, we just take it to the end of that, that down, and then there's just a, a few tolls, like bridges and stuff. There's nothing like I-95 on the way to Florida. There's toll bridges, but there's not like a like an I-95. Yes, there is. No, like this, where you yes. take the ticket and you pay like. Anthony, how many times have we gone down to Florida and you I don't, don't know, know that we have to pay tolls? No, I just said you pay tolls, but you don't pay like at each exit, each stop, like this. This, if you go to, if you go to one exit, it's like I don't know, a couple of bucks. If you go two exits, it's more. If you go all the way from beginning to you end. Maybe we have to take this road to go to Florida. I know. I said, but once we get past this, nobody listens to me. Once you we get no sense when you once talk. we get past this, then there's no toll roads like this they're just you pay for a bridge you pay for a tunnel you don't pay per exit but am I correct I know and I said that <laughs> so everybody can, can admit that I was correct no, you mis you <laughs> I know exactly no I didn't yes, I said did. exactly no, what I meant to say oh then you're both wrong yeah, and you made it sound like we didn't pay a toll in Jersey until we I got said down. no tolls like this where you pay per exit. And then, you know, uh, like you pay a graduated rate or whatever. Look at this truck. All right. <laughs> on that note, on the note where I was right and everybody else was wrong. Yeah, but you don't understand what I was saying. This ticket you pay per, per stop, right? Once you get past here and you leave New Jersey. So what he's trying to say is that what there's I no said. other toll road. That's what I said. That's not what you said. That's exactly what I said. You guys okay. just don't speak the English. <laughs> is it so lucky about toll roads? Not like this. Nothing's like this. How do you know? When was the last time we were in Philadelphia? For us. Never. For us. Because we don't go to Philadelphia. <laughs> when we go to Florida. <laughs> no, no, they don't have it. It's just you go over a bridge, you pay a toll. You go through a tunnel, you pay a toll. Blah, blah, blah. Stuff like that. All right. So on that note where I was right and everybody else is wrong. You're a dope. Because <laughs> I was right. He, you were wrong. He always does that. He speaks yeah. Only when I'm right and, then and you're wrong. He tries to wiggle his way out of it. But I'm right. you feel like you're the knucklehead and not him. Because I'm right and you're wrong. You guys are the wrong knuckleheads and I'm right. Two against one. There's know. no voting in the. It's like the Earth is flat. Two against one. Why are you going to the Earth is flat? <laughs> because it's wrong. It isn't flat. Might as well be saying the Earth is flat. Flat Earthers. <laughs> you guys are flat Earthers. What? John. Oh yeah, John. John doesn't believe the Earth is flat. All right. Anyway, on that note. Uh, Look at the trees. We got trees here. They're pretty little trees. We're gonna paint some pretty little trees today. All right, anyway, we're on the way. We're out of here. See you at Columbus. Bye. Marie's giving me money. Woohoo! Money that we pay for the goddamn toll. Where'd you know they get the Marie from here? Huh? Yeah, she knows. She's been here like a million times. Um, I'm actually filming now because I wanted to comment on how much the toll was. It's, it's more, it's, it's like around the New York price. Yeah. And that's for just riding on the road. Well, it's still that our taxes the pay for. Even with the gas and the gold and the toll. Well, no, think about it. It, it. it is cheaper if we take one spot. Of course, the spot isn't as big as the Meadowlands, right? 
Um, the but it's 20, it was 13, what was it, 13, uh, 30? Yeah, no, 1320, 1320. Uh, 1320 just to drive from point A to point B. And how much is it going to be going home? 1320. So it's like 2640 just to get here. Yeah, if, it used to be 20 bucks. It used to be 20 bucks, but they keep raising the tolls where we live. You know, nice regressive tax. I'm going to complain about that for a second. Thank you, Murphy. Yeah. For not and Christy, he's for, the one that doubled it. Thank you, Murphy, for not. Yeah. Christy, just as bad. They're all the same. Summer That's why they want to do a gas tax to fund the is? infrastructure. They're nuts. Yeah. Look, Arby's is right there. Next two rights. Look. Yeah, I see. I see it on the side. <laughs> it's on Arby's. The side. No, it's, be, right. it's behind. Uh, yeah, it's behind. Yeah, we used to go to Wendy's all the time. Because yeah. usually we didn't want like a huge. I totally uh, thought that was Arby's. Well, AJ found out. He's like, I always Arby's. liked Wendy's because the burgers were like a decent yeah. thickness. Yeah. And they were. Well, I like Arby's nice. We're actually not far from the market now. so. You know. I don't know if I've ever been. All right, anyway, I, w I just wanted to complain about the toll. So it's down enough. this way? Uh, what am I doing? <sighs> I have to go all the way down now and come all the way back. I'm like screwing around with this camera. All right, so here we are. And it's only, it's like two rows. And it's six o'clock. Because it's going to rain. And they're not going to let people in until seven? Yeah. Seven? Seven. Or 6.30, George. 6.30. Well, the f that field is empty right now. Um, I might go to the bathroom. In my pants. Um, so yeah, I'm just filming that. Yeah, you probably should just come down this way. But here it is. It's 6.30. It's a weird day. Yeah, there's a guy. He's got fruits. That field is empty. So basically, it's only one line. There's probably, what, like 40 vendors here right now? Yeah. I mean, maybe it'll get longer, but... Thursday, well, there's everybody with stuff. Look, everybody's got, like, What's all in the front like, seat. Oh, that's He's got records. Um, everybody's... Front seats are all loaded because everybody's driving like uh, small cars. Do you want to check know? out the people that are open? Me and you, Tony. Um, I'm. To I might just go to the bathroom. I'm gonna probably say. I mean, just leave me money in case I have. Oh, to I left in. you. I left you a lot of money. No, how much is it? It's like twenty bucks. So or give me how much is twenty? I thought it was twenty five. Twenty five, maybe. You got tons of money. In yeah, there. but I don't want to have to go digging through my purse mm -hmm. if I get up to the window. When are they letting us in? 6.30? 6.30, so 20 minutes. I mean, you can you can kind of dash through. I'm going to go to the bathroom. All right, let me turn this off. At 6 o'clock. This is what Columbus looks like at 6 o'clock. I got a feel. We're going to be in this field. Yeah, we're definitely going to be in this field because there's only like, what, 40, 50 vendors? And there's like nothing here. All right, let me just go. Uh, oh, this? I think he said 20 bucks. It's fair, right? It's an older one too, so. All right, uh, I'll just well fill my space. All right, let's see what we got. This is it. Um, I already sold a couple of hundred. Uh, Thirty in t-shirts. Are uh, you ready? You got fifteen? Uh, maybe. Let me take this off. All right. Uh, back to filling my space. Uh, I sold a bunch of Hess trucks, less than five bucks. Don't care. I just want to get rid of them. It's been interest on this, and this is a good price. Like, if you want to buy this for seventy-five bucks, come to the store. I sold some stuff out of here. I'm not taking stuff out. If it starts raining, I'm not dealing with it. Um, people ask about then sell those cases for uh, um, Nintendo and Super Nintendo. That I saw. I know I sold some T-shirts, uh, five bucks each on the tees. Okay. I sold a few wrestlers. I want to sell this original dirt and that Dyson. Let's see. Plushies are not too popular today. I sold any of those. I got a lot of people asking about this. I'm telling them a hundred because I think it's like three, which I think is fair. And we'll see. I'll take it home though. You know, if I got to put batteries in, I'll put batteries in it. If I got to put it on Facebook, I'll put it on Facebook. Um, I'm going to take that and move it to the front since I have some space. I got rid of that box. But, um, yeah, here, let me just I'll give a wide view of my space. There it is. The whole thing. The whole mess. All right. Okay, I'm walking. Uh, I'm in the main field. the antique side. Not a lot of vendors. I don't know if I'm going to find everything. Anything. People have been through 
And if I see anything good, I'm probably going to have to pay up for it, which is fine. But it's really good. It's worth it. I don't have a lot of time, so I just don't want to look for too long. So well, let's see what happens. I'll, I'll do a pickup video after I'm done with this. I was wondering what the crowd was over there. But it looks like it's... Uh, uh, looks like it's people looking at Disney pins. Crazy, right? I might make this a little bit different part of the video because this is the only thing I bought so far. I'm on the antique side, the gate, the fence size of the tree and the fence and whatever. Um, this was a fun story because I asked the guy, hey, how much you want for this enamel painting, right? It's signed Cardin. Cardin, I know that artist. I think it's Louis Cardin, something like that. I, I don't remember the first name, but as soon as I look him up, I'll find him. Um, so he says 50. I'm like, ah, right? So I, I just go like real low, figuring like I'll give it a shot, see what he says. I say, hey, would you consider 30? He's like, oh, I can't go that high, right? Uh, I'm low. And I was like, I figured he went. I thought he'd make it like 35. I might have paid 40. Um, but then it's kind of tight. You know, I think this is probably worth maybe 100 to 150. I'm not really sure. I haven't, I'm, I haven't had starters in a while. I just, I know they don't sell for a lot of money. I've had these and they're slow, slow sell. So he goes, oh, I can't go that low. He goes, but you know what? Listen, uh, I'm going to flip a coin and we'll, we'll see what happens. And I'm like, ah, oh, no, no, no. I, I don't have that kind of luck. Right. And he says, no, no, uh, listen, I'll tell you what the deal is, right? Because I said, yeah, you'll probably be like, if I lose, I give you 75 or 100. And if you win, you give it to me for like 30. He said, no, no, I'll tell you what it will do. He says, we'll flip a coin. Heads, I win. Tails, you lose. No. Uh, he said, head or tails, you pick, right? So he said, um, uh, you, you get it. You get it for 30. Uh, I get it. Uh, I'll take 40. So I said, okay, let's do it, right? And then he brought out the coin. I said, wait, let me see the coin. <laughs> so I checked both sides of the coin, right? And um, then he flipped, and I said, heads, and I actually got it for 30. I won uh, because it came up heads. The funny thing is, though, uh, I like he was, we talked for a few minutes. I said, you know what, let me give you 35, and I gave him 35 for it because that's kind of, I would have paid uh, like 35, 40. I, it's, I got to put it on eBay. I got to put it on eBay. That's where it'll sell, but it's still, I, I like it. I have a bunch of enamel paintings. So 35 is kind of where I really wanted to spend. Like if you would have said 35, I'm going to say, will you take 30? <laughs> but I would have paid 35 a second, and I did wind up getting it. All right. Uh, this is the pickup portion of the video. Video. Um, the stuff that I got today with AJ. Some of this AJ bought from self. Some I bought by myself. We met in the middle for a few things. I'll show you what I got first, and then I'll show you what AJ got. And then AJ could tell me what he got and why he bought it or whatever. I thought this was pretty cool. Um, that's just a, a like a pipe sculpture, copper pipe sculpture. Sculpture paid 15 for it. I thought it was cool enough. It's the lady wanted 20. It says the Plumber's Pipe People number 148 for Ethel and Paul Stambaugh by Charles W. Drock. Drac. December 28, 1997. Uh, yeah, that's right. I forgot. I forgot. Um, I saw Blue Bus Dave. And um, AJ, actually, you noticed him. AJ noticed him. So he was like, uh, oh, that's Blue Bus Dave. So I said, oh, hey, hey, Dave, how are you? And I talked to him for a second. He's like, what's that? He said, oh, that's pretty cool. But he, I don't think he pro probably the lady wanted 20. He probably didn't want to pay 20 for it. I don't even know why. Uh, basically, most of the stuff I bought here today, I could live without, you know. Yeah, uh, Oh yeah, somebody starts. Well, I didn't see him. We didn't see him score him. It wasn't like it happened right in front of us. Yeah, uh, but I mean, everybody knows what Migos are, and they're probably her time frame and her period, right? But uh, they were in the box, she said. So they were probably like really beautiful. But we don't know what she paid for them because we we overheard the conversation that the the person who sold them, and she probably didn't get them for free or anything. So, but good stuff you pay up for. So she probably paid up. Good stuff. It, I wish it was us. I mean, uh, you bought this. You like this. You, you said you felt it was real. In, in your heart, you think it's real and you're going to keep it? So it doesn't matter. <laughs> it can be a fantasy thing. I mean, it's probably real. Or not. All right. <sighs> okay, I'll go back to what... I'll go back to what I bought with AJ. Um, we bought these two records, right? Whoa. Uh, I won't say how much you paid for stuff. But enough... 
I don't think I don't think those are super valuable, but enough to make money. We bought these deep purples. I I kind of bought them probably. I should check the price on them. I probably paid almost what they're worth. <laughs> but AJ won them. But this this will pay for all the records, right? This one. This one's like uh, you said. You just sold it for like what? Thirty five. So we'll share that one. The record's actually in good condition, and it's Black Sabbath Mob Rules. Okay. Um, I had a story for this piece of artwork. Um, I'm going to tell it again real quick. This is an enamel on um, copper painting and by an artist named Cardin. I believe his first name is Lewis, right? And um, I already told the story, so I want to just make it real quick. Uh, I saw it with the vendor. I said, how much? She said, 50 bucks. What? Yeah, it's hot today. Uh, and they said I was going to cool down for the rain. Uh, I'm asking 100 on the scooter. It needs batteries. Yeah, it's like about a $300 scooter. I think the batteries run 50. Um, I'm getting ready to go. I would go 80 on it now. All right? All right. That's my e-scooter. Um, so anyway, the guy had it on the table. I said, how much? I, in my head, I wanted to pay like 30 at most. He said, uh, what, 35, right? He said 50. I'm like, ah. So I looked at the second and I said, hey, would you consider 30? He's like, no, I paid too much. Um, so, but he said, but I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll flip you for it. And I'm like, ah, no, I never win when you do that stuff, right? Um, and I said, and what are we going to flip? Like, if you win, I pay you 75 or 100, and I win, I get 30. He's like, no, no, no. What we'll do is, I go, if you win, if I win, oh, you give me 40. You win, uh, I'll sell it to you for 30. So I said, okay. Um, I said, and then he brought out the coin. I said, let me see the coin. I checked both sides. Who's calling me? Oh, it's Ed. I'm not talking to Ed right now. I'll talk to you later, Ed. Um, so, he, well, he called me earlier, but I said I was busy. Um, what's, what is that Santa thing? Uh, I did. He's not in. Uh, so anyway, they flipped the coin. Believe it or not, in air, I said heads and I won. So I got it for 30. But then I was like, you know what? I would have paid 35 for it. So I, I said, you know what? I'll give you 35 because he actually went down from 50 to, to, to 30. That's like a big, that's a big drop. So I said 35 and he was cool with that. Um, you got this. Oh, here, here's the last thing I got. Marie got some jewelry, but I don't think she got anything too special. Um, this is silver. It's 925 sterling. I, I like the design. It's pretty cool. Uh, I thought it had some mark. It's springy, apparently. I used to bend in that low. It has. I thought it had some mark in the center, but that might have just been scratches. But it's marked 925 here somewhere. It's still, it's still a cool piece. Four bucks. I paid less than scrap. Bought this broken Dr. Zayas um, thing. Only four bucks. Yeah, it was only four bucks. It's a display piece. We'll put it in the store. It's, it's hard plastic, and I guess it just snapped from age or sun or, or pressure. Somebody put on it. Um, we, AJ and I are sharing that. AJ bought this really nice uh, shirt. Uh, let's see. Bullet for my Valentine. Bullet for my Valentine. I guess it's a rock shirt. It's like concert or something. Did you, you didn't look it up? Ah, whatever. It was cheap. Uh... You got this fun plastic robot. Uh, this is a go-bot. Oh, this is a, it says Rogan, so it's a go-bot? Yeah. Sure, nice. Is this something we're sharing? Yeah. Okay. Uh, got these cool Pokemon gloves. pot holders, maybe. No, the gloves, yeah. They're in good shape, but it looks like they're open. They're not going to be worth that much. Remember the Pokemon cups I had? They're probably worth like 20 bucks, 15. You think he'll want them? Okay. Uh, and then, I guess the reason you bought this is because it was made by Coleco? Is there a game that goes with this or something? No? All right. Oh, I t somebody asked me on this. I told him 20 bucks. This for sale? Yeah, I got 100 on it. Um, it needs new batteries. Um, uh, yeah, I didn't have any other problems with it. Uh, batteries run about 50. Um, it's about a 300 or so dollar uh, um, scooter. And I'm getting ready to go. I'll take 80 for it if you want to do that. All right? But that's the best I can do. Mr. Potato and this. There's no game or anything that goes with this, right? No, okay. Everybody wants my scooter, but they, I think they want to give me like 20 bucks. And I, I'm not going to sell it for that. I thought I was going to sell these. Oh, here's a guitar. Uh, everybody looked at AJ's guitar. No bites. Uh, but yeah, oh, and I already showed this. AJ bought this today too. And I'll show in another portion of the video 
some jewelry that Marie got. All right, uh, this is gonna be a through the car window pickup of the stuff that Marie got. Is everything in your green baggie? This? Yeah. Well, this you got. Yeah, I did. It's I already showed that. Italy. I paid four bucks. Oh, that what it says, Sterling Italy? Mm -hmm. Kind of a nice looking piece. Yeah. Okay. That's the only piece of jewelry I got, but I got that early before you even got uh, out of the car. This is Brighton. Oh, Brighton, nice. What'd you pay? Uh, What'd you pay for everything? I paid. Um, you can do by the piece if you want. Uh, I paid 25 for these three pieces. I paid two for this. 27. And I paid seven for that. 30, uh, four. Okay, 34 for everything. So the Brighton piece. That's good. That's at least 20 up, right? I got these. Those are nice. Um, I think they're gold plated. I'm okay. not sure. It says double on it. Right. Ugh, my hands are they're so probably dirty. Not sterling. That's okay. Oh, I clipped my fingernails last night, so they don't look like um, that. Um, this was a pearl collar. That's pretty. That I thought was cool. Somebody's gonna want that. You do well with those. This was a JJ pin, but you could put a photo in there. Sweet. I thought that was fun. You know, it'd be funny. Put a photo See, of Santa in there. It's JJ. That's actually this cool was, one. I've had this before with a lady's face. I had okay. never seen one with Kennedy. I have not either. So maybe. But it's a coin that somebody actually. Ah, they embossed the Kennedy face. Let me see mm -hmm. if I can get this in focus. I mean, it's probably not worth a lot. No, but not worth a lot. It's, I never well, saw you never know. Before. It could be. You figure 15, 20 bucks at least. Uh, Look at these, those scratches from the kitten. From the cat. Yeah, from the kitten. These are um, swank. Okay. But they're really cool. I they're actually like... saw a, a cool pair of cufflinks I would have bought. Except it wasn't a pair. It was just one. So I was like, oh. I just like the design of them. I thought they were really cool. Yeah, they're kind of modernist. Yeah. You know, kind of like, um, what do you call it? Uh, industrial? This, this was, yeah, that was a nice piece. It's a nice stone necklace. Is that, you think it that's has like a jade sterling or... clasp. I don't think that's... Well, I like I like the stones in there. It's really good looking. Is it agate or I mean? It doesn't look like agate. I you know I don't really know. I, I, it's just nice. Yeah, it's for, it's actually a really nice one with a sewing class. That was that and was a good price. Is, I paid the most for this. Okay. It's oh, a, it's a locket. Yeah, it's an Art Deco locket. The chain and the locket are marked sterling, which okay. ages it. You know, it doesn't say nine to five. Sure. The only issue is that somebody had put a four leaf clover in it. Oh. That got. Deteriorating. Yeah, so mm -hmm. I had to take that out and hopefully I could clean it. But see, it's Mark Sterling, and there's um, a maker's mark that okay. I. It might be a W, I'm not sure. All right. So, overall, how do you feel about our trip to Columbus? Um, I mean, the stuff I got's okay. Yeah, it's no big deal, right? Same for me. Um, I got that enamel painting. They Did like Art Deco stuff, so. Did you see my enamel painting? Yeah, I saw you show it to Glenn. What do you think about it? I mean, it's nice. nice. Right? You like those things. He's actually a good artist, so, you know. I thought you got more stuff, because when you came back. No. You could, like, well, vegetables Well, I had or tomatoes and cucumbers. <laughs> That's so okay. So there's a guy that sells them yeah. and grows yeah. them. Nice. So, we yeah, actually saw... Oh, I told you I saw Blue Less Dave, right? I got cucumbers. Nice. Sweet. And I got pickles. tomatoes. Pickle-sized cucumbers. Well, he had smaller ones, that, so you can make them into Goikins. cucumbers. Um, what's that? Um, oh, the tomatoes? Tomatoes. Mmm, nice. Check out those tomatoes. Um, yeah, I saw Blue Bus Dave, so I said hello to him for a minute. I showed him my, my uh, Jesus pipe sculpture, you know. But, yeah, I mean, I sold some. I ain't getting rich, I'll tell you that much. Mm. Well, that's just it. It's like, I don't feel like Yeah. I found such great stuff. I mean, uh, if I didn't find that's a, this that's stuff... That's a light vendor day, I guess. There's two things I just wanted to sell just so I don't have to put them back in the shop, but I don't think they're going to go for it. They're being too cheap. So, another day, I guess. All right, anyway, let me go back. i got to go help somebody. Get rid of, so I moved it to the front, but I half expect people to just come up and be like... <laughs> la, 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 la. <laughs> All right. So it has been like we gotta go to Arby's. We gotta go to Arby's. We gotta go to Arby's. So we went to Arby's, right? And Arby's has this deal right now where you get a dollar uh, float, right? And usually what they do is it's Dr. root beer, Dr. Pepper, root beer, Dr. Pepper, Coke. Coke. But I like I like it with orange, right? Um, we got root beer. Um, and the funny thing is, so I asked for the orange, and at first I'm like, no, that's the orange cream. I'm like, no, I don't want the orange cream. I just want orange soda, right? And I'm like, yeah, no big deal, right? And then. When we asked him, what did he say? 
first one ever. That that they never made an orange uh, float for anybody before. When it comes, they put the orange up to here, the soda, and then just drop the ice cream in. But we kind of mix it up like this. Yeah, AJ didn't mix it up as much. You never had one before. What do you think? It's good. I know, right? That's my favorite thing. I literally had one last night. <laughs> Not from Arby's, so I'm making one. I forgot. The lady said it sounded so good she's going to have one. The lady that works there. I had to add that in. So at Arby's, so, so, so at Arby's you got to ring the bell when you have good service. Ring the Arby's bell. Ding dong. Wait, hold on. I don't know why Google just popped up. Okay, go. Ring it. Then ring that Arby's bell. Ring it. Why? Did you already? Yeah, it's recording. Do I have Anthony's gonna ring the Arby's bell for good service. <laughs> no problem. Bye. How'd you like ringing that bell? You can ring my Arby's bell. I'm, I'm very happy that the Arby's here. Remember when we have these you talk about Wendy's? Fuck yeah. Wendy's. We can get Wendy's. We, we can get Wendy's in Little Fairy. You know? That is true.